Jason Nolf. Thank you, luck, guys. 22 and 0, ranked number one. Nolf right, almost immediately right in on a shot. And, and he's another guy just like Rutherford that just loves keeping that high pace and you able to take advantage of his you know, scrambling ability, gets on shots, and, 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 and great endurance for this guy. Again, another tough order for the Buckeye to try to keep this match close. I mean, Nolf coming off of a magnificent performance against Isaiah Martinez, national champion, getting a fall in that match. But, you know, it's interesting to see how you follow it up. And I think big matches like these were necessarily you're heavily favored, but to go out there and, and uh, there has to be a little bit of a coming down period off of a big, uh, uh, you know, match like that where you pin the national champion. But well, if you him. listen to the interview, to it doesn't seem like uh, Nolf was too far up or too far down. He said, yeah. I expected it. And uh, yeah. there's a big two-point takedown slick by Jason Nolf. Goes out in front 2-0. Beautiful elbow pass. And basically Watch an attack both out. legs in that situation. And, you know, he is just a hammer in the top position, just like Rutherford, but in almost in a different way. He likes to work more bar arms. Keep it flat 90. I'm on it. Yeah. Got a nice work there with the arm behind the back. Watch it. Just so much pressure in every position by Nolf. You've seen him since high school, Jim, and you saw him at the Disney Duels, and you knew he was good when you saw him. Well, yeah, it, it's, it's you know, my friends from Pennsylvania said, hey, look at this guy, and I said, hey, oh boy, <laughs> he's going to have a great future. Oh, by the way, where's he going? He's, he's committed to Penn State. <laughs> yeah. So... I mean, the, the, the stars that, that uh, you know, the stars in this duel, man, are just fantastic, and their age is just like, it's just off the charts. I mean, these guys are freshmen and sophomores and world champions and potential national champions. It's really cool to see. We talked about the significance. There's two more points of this duel meet. The, if Penn State wins, they will be in the national championship duel presented live by Beat Keen and Cliff Keen Athletic. On the tip. Sometimes it's sometimes it's difficult, you know, when you when you have, you know, you're supposed to go out there and get bonus points for your team, and you're a heavily favored guy. It's it's you know, and the guy is, um, let's face it, I mean, Jake Ryan totally understands what his role may be in this situation is not to give up too many bonus points. So it's hard to go ahead and you know, you go out there maybe the first three four techniques you know hit all your stuff on the feet but you're really kind of thinking feet to the back you know if, uh, improve, improve. sometimes you can think it slowed down in that process warning red warning against Jake Orion the red shirt freshman going up against another red shirt freshman one's got a bit of a different trajectory this season right now, Jason Nolf does not get the two points. And Jason Nolf out in front, four to two. He's our Coyote Logistics No Excuse Impact Wrestler. Scoring more points, team points, than any other wrestler in the nation. Ranking first for the team points he brings in every dual meet and second in pins in the nation with 10. Jason Nolf, our Coyote Logistics No Excuses Impact Wrestler. Ryan will go ahead and take the down position, and so he is thinking about, uh, you know, not giving up anything in this situation as far as team points are concerned, but uh, Nolf in on a figure four. There, like what we saw with uh, with Conaway in that position, they worked that for a long period of time. And, and, and with... Jake Ryan has to do is keep his forehead off the mat. If he can go ahead and do that, give the official the impression that you're, you're trying to go ahead and you know, compete down there, but it's tough when that guy has that leg in like that. And, and Nolf is so active with it. So now he's going to go ahead and let the, give the escape. He's going to try to do this on his feet. Nolf out in front, 4-1. to one. He's got riding time. Been putting the pressure on uh, Jake Ryan the entire time, but right now, with a minute left in the second period, with only a warning, one warning, he's not been penalized yet. The one point, Jake Ryan. And Ryan has played that edge about as well as you can play it there under the circumstances, and they're going to call a stalemate. So, milked a little bit of clock. You know, he, he tried to keep his team within range there against the number one ranked wrestler in the country. Nice shot to the 
Other side, no, both course, sides of the body that time. Exactly, he went one way, came back to the other way, and uh, looking to get the two points, and he does know, does Penn State, the ranked, number one ranked wrestler. Okay. Four number one ranked Nittany Lions. So I, you know, crowd not happy that he's not getting a stall call here, but you know, he's not, he's presenting himself, Ryan is at this stage. There's the shot that he had at the end of the first period. A little crack down, passes across the other side, picks up the takedown, jumps out eight to four. On, nine seconds left, you're probably gonna keep him down. And that will be the end of the second period. Scores eight to four, and also two minutes of riding time. Undefeated, Tom Ryan, encouraging words to his 157 pounder that also, said, also top, happens to be his son, Kale, and his brother, Cody Sanderson. It's a family affair. Both highly successful coaches. In the last five years, these are the only two teams that won the NCAA championship. Ohio State winning their first ever last year. Penn State winning four in a row prior to that. Nice duck under there by Noel, but it wasn't clean. Now he's going to work out with the double overhooks, maybe go feet to the back. Again, Ryan has got called for stalling here again. There's but, one but, stalling for Ryan, a minute and a half left. But, you know, it, 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 to, to some degree, and I'm not an apologist here for him, and it's clear he's trying to keep it close, but he hasn't backed off the mat. I mean, he's given up right there, that position. He's got, he just got knocked in the head. Yeah. Just got knocked in the head. And uh, so they did. They collided. You see. Yeah. You can't. I think that the, the uh, replay here so will verify so what you said no there, Tim, is that. You can't coach on this, okay? You take a look at this. Now, obviously, the partisan crowd yelling he's tired, but he did, he got banged right. Boom. Yeah. Maybe with the, 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 the shoulder right there. But, yeah, he did kind of take it in the, uh, the ear hole there. Yeah. I think it was a shoulder on that head there. Yeah. Yeah, but if you want to try that at home, you know, get about three or four paces back and run into the wall. <laughs> doesn't feel good. No, so, it doesn't. Yeah, so now Nolf will probably choose down. Right. He gets his choice when the injury time, uh, the uh, uninjured, non-injured wrestler will get his choice. You have to go back to your corner. You can either evaluate him here or take him back to the room. You have all kinds of time. Yeah, they're going to go through the concussion, uh, concussion protocol. They have to go through the concussion protocol, and that will slow things down because the official has to take them off the mat in the back room and um, go through tests. So on Sunday, February 21st, we saw how many of them are in the top 20, and so this year, it's the Big Ten Conference hosting, then the other seven power wrestling conferences, and uh, plus a wild card. Here's the invited Big Ten teams already. These will host Penn State, Iowa, Michigan, Ohio State, Nebraska, Rutgers, Indiana, Minnesota. Then the schools like North Carolina State and uh, Missouri and Oklahoma State and Virginia Tech and from the other conferences will meet up in a kind of a bowl-like weekend. One day, one round at eight schools, matching the highest ranked Big Ten teams against the highest ranked winners from the seven other Division I wrestling conference. You're sure? Okay, make that note at concussion time. Yeah, cleared by Jake Ryan is struggling here. It's he cleared him. And they're gonna keep continue on. They determined it wasn't a uh, concussion, it was concussion time. and that so he can bottom. continue to wrestle. We're talking about Jake Ryan, who... He's going to use optional start on you. Set. Go ahead. Set. So right now, okay. uh, Jake Ryan starts on the bottom. He gets one, and Nolf out in front, 14 to 6. Working on a tech fall. Right now, he's got a major decision, winning by eight or more. So he's got that extra point in on the leg, coming around. No points. But you can see where Nolf has the activity level to be able to do what he's doing against really high-level people like Mar Mar Martinez. I mean, his footwork is solid. He's attacking all the time. And that, that should, he, that's not a stall warning necessarily on Ryan, so to speak. That's just Jason 
Nolf earning a stall warning on his opponent. It's kind of a, it happens. One point, stalling, 15-6. Nolf trying to finish off Ryan here in the third period. 30 seconds left, he's out front 15-6. to six. There's a four point for the team if it ended right here. Ryan trying to keep from, and there's one, one, stalling. How many is that? He's got to step forward. That's his third point or two points. Next one, DQ. And that's a situation where Nolf just is like, he's earning these points right now just with his activity. Again, Ryan is not backing out. Two. In on the leg. Got the takedown, one back point, one set of back points, one no set change, of swipes no change, anyway. No change, Swipe. No change. Still here. Solid performance by Noel. And with Ryan, and that's 19 to 6. Falls a little short of the 15 point tech fall. Your winner by major decision, still undefeated. Number one ranked Nittany Lion, Jason Nolf.